What's up guys, welcome to the official first video of what I'm calling the Just Another Muggle 90 Day Fat Loss Challenge. So yes, I'm doing a 90 Day Fat Loss Challenge. I'm gonna give you the context as to why, but first, I wanna tell you why I decided to name it the Just Another Muggle Challenge. If you don't know what a muggle is, first of all, you gotta read the Harry Potter books. Like, if you don't know what a muggle is, it's a huge fucking mistake. You, the book, you gotta read the books. Not just the movies, the movies are, they're, they're overrated. The books are better. Anyway, a muggle, in Harry Potter terms, is non-magic folk. It's a regular person, someone who doesn't know how to do magic, or they can't do magic. And I think that a lot of what we see on Instagram and YouTube are these like super jacked, super ripped, uh, super fit, like these, these physiques that are unbelievable. And a lot of times it's like they're, they seem like too good to be true, like almost unattainable. And I think that in many ways, those physiques are, are extraordinary and they're a lot, they can be very motivational and like to get you to work harder. I think in other instances, I know a lot of people sometimes feel unmotivated or demotivated from them. They sometimes make themselves feel bad because they're like, well, I, I don't even want to look like that. I just want to be healthier. I want to feel better. I want to move. I don't want to be jacked or ripped, but I just want to feel good and be happy and healthy. I wanted to name it the Just Another Muggle Challenge because I'm not a high level physique competitor. I'm not jacked out of my mind. I'm not super shredded and that's not my goal. My goal is to show you that if you just want to lose some fat, if you just want to feel better, be healthier and have nutrition that helps you be healthier and achieve your goals without taking over your entire life, that's what this is for. And over these 90 days, I'm going to document everything that I eat, my weigh-ins every day, um, my exercise, just everything. And you'll see, it's nothing special, it's nothing crazy. And you'll also see my progress picture updates, my weigh-ins every single day on Instagram. You'll see like what a sustainable approach looks like, the ups and the downs of it, the goods and the bads, not gonna hide anything. If I'm having a bad day, you'll see it. If I'm having a good day, you'll see it. It's not just highlighting the highlight reel. It's showing you exactly what life is actually like and what you can expect. If I'm hungry, I'll tell you I'm hungry. If I'm feeling good, I'll tell you, it's, it's, it's just fully inclusive. I wanna show you everything. No lies, no bullshit. There's no product, there's no pitch, there's no sale, it's just truth. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, Rico, you could put the, my Instagram handle here. Rico's behind the camera, by the way. I fucking love this guy. Um, I recently made a post, it was about a week ago, in which I explained this Just Another Muggle Challenge, where I explained how I used to be an elite powerlifter. I competed in powerlifting for years, I set several world records, I deadlifted four times my body weight, squatted three times my body weight, my, my powerlifting was my life. For years and years and years, I never missed a single training session, I maintained well below 10% body fat year round. Um, and then when I started coaching Gary Vaynerchuk, I really started to focus more on my business. And I, I focused less and less and less on my own personal fitness and strength and conditioning. And it, honestly, it was very difficult for me to share that post because I don't like looking at, at how I've let myself go. I, don't, I mean, I'm in no way saying that I'm unfit or that I, I'm like overweight, but I am saying that compared to where I was, compared to how, how big of a life, how big of a part of my life fitness was, I don't like what happened. I will say I don't regret it. I don't regret focusing more on my business. I don't regret everything that I've done over the last two and a half years because even though my fitness wasn't my priority, the amount that I've been able, been able to accomplish with my business, the amount that, of people I've been able to help, Instagram wouldn't have blown up for me if I didn't do it. I wouldn't have this YouTube channel. I probably wouldn't be talking to you right now if it didn't happen, which makes everything that I sacrificed so much worth it. Because now I know, I always know what I, how to get back into fitness. It's already, I already know how to do it. And now because of all the work I've done the last two and a half years, I can show you how to do it too. And I'm excited to go on that journey with you together. So really this, this whole journey, this whole 90 days is to show you what's realistic, how to accomplish it, how to structure your nutrition, how to structure your workouts, how to incorporate all of this into your life so that your life doesn't have to revolve around all of it. So that you can still enjoy your favorite foods, you can still have fun, it doesn't have to be obsessive. And just to show you how to do it, like a regular person, just another muggle. With that being said, I have a challenge for you a challenge in which I've already started. So what you'll see is Rico will show you, I've been posting my weight every day on my Instagram story. Uh, the first day that I started, before I even really started this challenge and made it public, I weighed 153 pounds. This morning, I believe I weighed 147.2. 
and but throughout the when I first started posting my weights, it was like 147, then it was 147.4, 147.4, then 147.2, and actually from today it was 140, it was 148.2, then I went P, and then it was 147.2, and so that's sort of like the stuff where people are like, oh my god, like I don't realize that sometimes you could pee that much weight. So point being, I would love for you to join me on Instagram, posting your weight every day, because what, what will happen is if you post your weight every day, you'll start to see that fluctuations happen all the time. You'll spike up for no reason, you'll drop down for no reason. Um, hormones play a role in it, just like sodium plays a role in it, how late you ate plays a role in it. And all, and all this I wanna talk about in this series, in this challenge, in these 90 days. But if you do it with me, and you decide to join in, you'll get firsthand experience in it too. And a hashtag, just another muggle, hashtag just another muggle in your story so I can see it and I can share it. You don't have to do it by all, at all. It's not an obligation obviously, but I encourage you to try it and join me in this challenge because if you do, I think you might be surprised at how much you realize the scale doesn't have any power over you. The scale doesn't really matter. It's just a number, it's good data, but it's not the end all be all. It shouldn't control your life. So. That's it. I'm really excited for the challenge. I am, I am like a little bit nervous, you know? I'm putting my entire fat loss phase over the next 90 days public, which is like not the easiest thing to do, but I'm excited about it. And, I, and above all else, I'm excited because you'll get to see the truth. You'll get to see like, if I'm really hungry, you're gonna see it. If I'm like really tired in the gym, you're gonna see it. It's not just gonna be like a filtered Instagram picture that like, oh, look how great I'm looking, I feel fantastic and I can eat what I want and show pictures of Pop-Tarts, when in reality the majority of my meals are like vegetables and lean protein, and that's it. And like, I will have nights where I go to bed and I'm not really 100% full or satisfied. Like, hunger is a part of this journey and I wanna show you exactly what I'm going through so you know exactly what to expect. So, that's it. If you like this video, if you're really in for the journey with me, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you don't already. Make sure you hit the bell. There's a bell in there that you get notified when a new video comes up. I'll be updating this series every Sunday, I believe. A new video every Sunday with the week, with my weights, with my thoughts, my emotions, the, the videos, the workouts, nutrition, all that stuff. So hit the bell after you subscribe. I appreciate you. Leave a comment, whether it's words of encouragement, something you have a question about, something you'd like me to answer. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. I love you. Talk to you soon.